guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be going over my summer bucket list. This is a list that I have made with the kids. We do this every single summer. We make a list of everything that we want to accomplish in the summer and then we like check them off as we go. So this video is extra special because it is in collaboration with my two best friends here on YouTube. Stacy from Boy Mom Vlogs and Jessica from The Gentry Balance. Now I'm gonna have those channels linked down below. The thing that's cool about this is that all three of us live in different places. Stacy and Jessica are both in America, but Jessica's in Nebraska and Stacy's in California. And then I'm over here in Canada on Prince Edward Island. So our lists might have some similarities, but I think they're gonna differ a bit. So I'm really excited to see what they have on their list and hopefully you guys can get some ideas from the three of us of what it, you might want to do this summer. As of right now, my kids are actually still in school. When this video gets posted, they are going to be done of school tomorrow. So we are so excited to start our summer break. The first thing on our bucket list this summer is camping. We've already accomplished this. We have gone camping a few times so far this summer, but we plan on like camping the entire summer or as much of it as we possibly can. So that is the first thing on my summer bucket list. Another thing that's on our bucket list is beach days. We live on an island, so beaches are pretty close to pretty well everywhere. Like, no matter where you are here, you're close to a beach. And we plan on spending as much time as possible there. Pack a lunch, pack some snacks, pack lots of water and sunscreen beach choice and just go for the whole day. Like that is one of our, our most favorite things to do in the summer. We have so much fun at the beach and I am not a pool girl. Like I don't swim in pools like ever. I don't know, it's just a thing. But beach water has my heart. I swim, I love beach water. So I'm really excited for the beach. This is kind of a similar thing as beach days, but we, another thing we want to do is we want to watch the sunset on the beach. Now this is a tradition that we actually just started last summer, but um, Trevor and the kids and I, we all go to the beach close to sunset. We play a bit in the sand and the kids, oh, I think last year they actually ended up getting wet, but um, go in the water and stuff and then we have um, like a blanket place down and we just sit on the blanket and watch the sunset on the water. You guys, if you have not done this, you have to watch the sunset on the beach. It is the most beautiful thing you'll ever see. Another thing we want to do is go spend the day at the park. We have a park here that has a pool and a splash pad and just tons of things for the kids to do there. The kids really enjoy like picnics, so we, like we'll pack a lunch, um, they'll go swimming, they'll go on the splash pad, and there's actually lots of trails. They have like a wooded area and there's trails that you can walk all through. So that's always one of our favorite days in the summer when we go to Victoria Park. The next thing on our list is the drive-in. Now, I know this is not something that everybody has, so this might be interesting to some of you. It's basically like an outdoor theater. You watch the movies on the big screen in your car. So everyone, it's like a very like 50s style type of thing. That The theme of ours is very 50s. And you, they usually play two, sometimes three movies, and it's like so cheap compared to the movie theater. The kids love going to that. We usually go in our jammies and then just like snuggle in the car and watch the movies. It's a lot of fun. So that's on our bucket list. Another thing that we want to do is we want to go strawberry picking. We usually only do that once in the summer. The next thing that I have is going to the teacup rock. I have never been to the teacup rock and I all I see is pictures of it all over social media. I think it is so beautiful, but basically it's like a naturally made, obviously it's natural, it's a rock, but it's like shaped into like a teacup and it's so beautiful and it's just, it's, a, it's on the beach I think or water or I don't really know but I don't even really know where it is but I'm gonna find it this summer and I'll vlog the whole thing but that is like 
I want to go to the teacup rock. So this is that's my thing. Like that's I put that on this list. I was like, we're going to the teacup rock. The next thing we want to do is we want to go to the zoo. That's something that we have done every single summer since the kids have been born. We've taken them to the zoo every year. And the very last thing is the thing you guys that I am the most excited for and I have been absolutely dying to tell you guys all about this. The thing I'm looking forward to most this summer and it's on my bucket list and not only was it on my summer bucket list but it was just on my life bucket list in general is my friend Stacy, who this video is in collaboration with Boy Mom Vlogs is coming to Canada to Prince Edward Island to come visit me. And I am so excited, you guys. She is coming and she's staying with me for a week. I met Stacy four years ago on YouTube and we have talked every single day since and now we're finally meeting. So it's Stacy, Jessica and I, all three of us, our besties. Um, Stacy and Jessica actually met in Nebraska a couple years ago and I wasn't able to go. But this year Stacy's coming to visit me and I am so excited. Stacy has never been to Canada. She's from California. So you guys, you guys should definitely check out her channel and subscribe to her because she is going to be vlogging her entire trip here. I will be vlogging it too, but if you want to see it from like her perspective, then it might be a good idea to like head over to her channel and subscribe. And she's gonna be vlogging her like getting ready to come see me and and I, I'm just so excited because I can tell you guys now because like I've been sending her gifts in the mail and she's been um, shopping for me and I'm shopping for her and I have and I'm just so excited to um, start sharing this part on YouTube because it is a huge part of our summer this year. To have Stacy come and stay with us for a week, I'm just so excited. Honestly, you guys, there's no words. Like, I don't know how you explain meeting your best friend for the first time because I feel like it doesn't happen that often. Because normally you meet someone and then you become best friends, but we are best friends, but we haven't met. Um, it sounds crazy, it's really not. She lives in my phone, we video chat every single day, and it's time to meet, you guys. It's time to meet. So she's coming here with her youngest boy and we're just gonna kill this summer. We're gonna have so much fun and I'm just really looking forward to having her come here and share her with you guys. So that is my summer bucket list, you guys. I hope you guys took some ideas off of that and don't forget to check out Jessica's bucket list and don't forget to check out Stacy's bucket list and leave in the comments below what are some things you have planned for this summer because I would really love to hear it because I definitely could add to my list. We really like to keep busy in the summer so if you have any ideas or suggestions at all, please leave them in the comments below and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!